Hello and welcome. This is Gigi and this is a weekly tarot reading for my Cancers for the week starting May 9, 2016. And if you'd like to have a private reading from me, you can send me an email at ggleetarot at gmail.com. You can also subscribe to my channel. I would be very appreciative. Thank you for those who subscribed already and welcome to my new subscribers. Thank you all for your likes, your shares, your comments, your private messages. It truly means so much to me. And I also posted below the video where you could find me on social media as well. And now my cancers, on to your reading. I want you to know that prior to recording your reading, I meditate and ask spirit for guidance and I shuffle the cards as well. So let's see what we have in the past position this week. We have the Magician. Powerful card, definitely. Uh, this is the card number one in the tarot deck. This deck is by Morgan Greer. So the Magician is a major arcana. Even in this position, the energy will remain through the week. It's all about being in possession of all the possibilities. Okay, As you see, there's a table there with all the tools that are required. Okay, Swords, cups rods and um uh, which one did it say swords cups rods and uh, pentacles here okay so here it's about you being able to manifest your true desires it's going towards a goal a specific goal okay i think some of my cancers have now entered a different type of cycle in their life a different type of energy is coming in and this energy is allowing you to make anything happen or to become anybody. Okay, maybe now you have a different vision of yourself or a different vision of what you want in your relationship. And you're going to go in that direction. You're going to manifest exactly what you want. So it's a very powerful energy. It's one of the best cards actually in the whole deck. Because it says that here, you know, because you see he has a cap. We don't know what, you know, when you're, he's turning his back at something. Okay, so here, whatever your intention are, okay, you have, you are walking into a cycle when you can emerge differently, okay, in your career, in your love, in your health, if you want to have a better health or, you know, in different areas of life. So it's a powerful energy. And let's see what we have for you, my cancers, in the position of the near past this week. The Four of Swords. Interesting. Okay, so the Four of Swords in this position, it really is about spiritual retreat. It represents a certain amount or a certain energy connected to solitude and uh, rest. Okay, it could be because now, you know, and Cancer are like this. They like to really spend some time inward in order to come out stronger. So now you, you have this vision for yourself. You're meditating on how to go forward, okay? Clearly, we could see that, you know, there's this serious um, beginning ahead of you and you really want to make sure that you're going in a direction that you will be able to fulfill your desires, okay? And so let's see what we have in a position of the future for you this week. We have the death card. Interesting. So yes, there's definitely an ending and a new beginning here. This is an, another major arcana. So in the astrological belt, the death card represents Scorpio. When the energy of this card is about transformation. Okay? It's like I said, you're shedding something... Uh, you're shedding your skin. You're, you're removing yourself from old habits, old, old uh, view, vision of, of people or old um, mentality, okay? And you're creating something new for yourself. So there's definitely something that you're turning your back at, okay? What we know so far is you have a lot of energy right now in your 11th house, okay? Which is the house of uh, Taurus for you. Okay, Taurus is the 11th sign starting from yourself. 11 house represent group, network, uh, circles, leadership, okay, friends, activities, 
profits okay so maybe the people around you now you're 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 having a different um how can i say you want to maybe be a part of a different social group or you have a different ambition in terms of who you want to be with what time you want to spend with the people that are around you maybe some of them will be ending because the death card is about ending before the beginning we're ending something so maybe there's a few relationship that you know you're thinking now or a few um group circles that you used to belong to that are now closing in it could be in different areas of life however like i said there's a lot of energy in that sector for you my cancer so let's see what we have in a position of the outcome for you this week the three of pentacles great so with that you're putting your head into focusing on creating some type of profits for you creating some wealth okay um mostly the three of pentacles is about being admired at work appreciation work well done and with that comes some type of profits because pentacles is about money as well it's about money resource health so maybe now you have this vision for yourself where you want to work better or you want to have a better health for yourself you want to have you want to feel good you want to have a different admiration coming towards you you want to be appreciated and you're you want to do the necessary you you're ready to do the work okay as you see three of pentacles is about doing work but also what it could represent is you you know as a part of a team as a part of a group where you want to attach yourself or um uh you want to involve yourself differently okay so as you're shedding some some relationship away you're shedding your skill your skin sorry there's other relationship where you'll be more involved you'll be working harder you want to get some appreciation from the people that you value the people that you think is important and the reason why i say this is because taurus is all about value worth taurus no value more than any other sign so this is the energy coming out for you with you know in your 11th house so there's a lot of things concerning what you value how you want people to see you how you want to look how good you want to feel but i'm going to end this reading here for you my cancers let me know how this resonated with you leave me comments until next week send you lots of kisses i love you